I saw a joint video about uh, magnet timing and the strobe method but it reminded me of the way I've been setting mine up uh, just on this little uh, circuit of mine one of the white crow circuits um, what I have is an LED which is there and it connects just directly to the coil output for 3 to 6 volts I use that but can use um, a neon instead connected across which also shows the AC spikes so at 3 volts here the light will be on or well presumably always on because it's going towards the coil but what the effect is just turning by hand you can see the light go on and off and gives the range to which you wait until it goes off there and each magnet of course on oh, mine in any case uh, you can change the position of just by shifting across with the fingernail or whatever because it sticks to the side of the ro rotor but I just thought I'd show that that sort of thing is quite effective also you get the strobe effect uh, start the rotor up and say this is on 3 volts at the moment and what could be possible is to have like an old record player where they had the little notches and you could line up with the strobe effect such that you could check RPM when you move the voltage higher so up to 6 volts here the light remains obviously more constant but that would allow the uh, turntable type effect um, so you could line up with the different voltages and check that things are running fine so yeah I just thought I'd show that as a, an alternative method and perhaps easier um, or if people haven't got strobes such as myself